Hey there guys, welcome back. My name's Sada Plays. I hope you're all well. In today's video, we're starting off by looking at Daisy standalone and some of the changes that are coming with Beta. And also we're gonna be answering that question, where is Frankie? What has he been doing? And is he dead? I could assure you Frankie isn't dead. Me and him have been plotting a devious plot of how to get back at the guys that killed Steve the cow. Yeah. We have been brooding in the jungle, haven't we, about Steve's death every night, reminiscing, telling stories, haven't we, about how beautiful his fur was. <laughs> he wasn't a normal cow with all that fur, but like yeah. we loved it. More on Frankie a little bit later, but first of all, let's have a little bit of a look at some of the changes that are coming up in daisy standalone there's some really cool stuff that i'd like to show you the developers behind daisy standalone recently announced that they was going to open it up to modding so that means the community can mod the base game of daisy standalone so hopefully in the future we can have battle royale daisy standalone overpock overwatch origins maybe all the stuff that was in armor 2 and armor 3 we could have in Daisy standalone. Some of the stuff that is coming up in Daisy Beta will actually blow your mind. If you're a long-term Daisy standalone player and you've kind of forgotten about the game, you haven't tried it for a bit, I do think that when Beta comes out, you're really gonna wanna give it a go again. One of the things that I'm really happy about that they're introducing in Daisy Beta is you can run up hills. No more zigzagging. Also some new falling animations so you don't just kind of fall like a stiff plank and break your legs. Also they're adding a lot of new animations like for the different melee weapons and like the ragdoll effects of the zombies and the players when you kill them. I think just little touches like this of different animations when you hit the zombies with different weapons and stuff really adds to the immersion of the game overall. I think they've done a really good job. This is a little sneak peek which uh, Daisy Bohemia released to show of the new Daisy beta and I think so far it's looking amazing. Another really cool thing that they're introducing is every weapon is going to have its own reload animation and its own jamming animation. So if you get a shotgun and it jams, you'll do like a different animation, maybe tap it on the top to open it. Or your pistol, maybe you'll hit it on the side if you get a jam. And I just think all these different options makes the game so much more immersive and fun. This is a really cool idea too. If you look at the screen, you can see he's got a beard and his face is a little bit scarred up. Well, the longer your character lives, the longer his facial hair will grow and his face will start to get like scars and marks on there. So you can tell if somebody's a long-term survivor or not. I think that's really, really cool. But of course, you can always shave and maybe try and fool people that you're not a long-term survivor. I really, really like this mechanic. What I think would be amazing is if, if you was a, a bandit, say like if you'd killed 10 people, your clothes would become like blood stained. I really think that is a cool idea. So you could like see someone from a distance and be like, oh, there's a player. And then when you get close to him, you can be like, oh my God, he's got blood on him. He's a bandit. I just think things like that could be very, very cool. Recently, I've been playing a lot of Daisy Standalone. And here's a little clip of some action I got up to around Berezino. There's some servers at the moment where the admins take advantage of the persistence mechanic and they fill tents up with loads of guns that you can take at the beginning of the server start. So everyone rushes to the tents, get guns, and it's just like a little death match. I've been playing this and it's actually super, super fun. It gives you a chance to try all the different guns out because in the actual survival part of the game, it's very rare that you find yourself like an SVD with all the ammo or an M4A1 fully kitted. So it's actually fun just getting one out of a tent and doing a bit of deathmatch. So anyway, back to the action in Berezino. I was actually looking for this player and I thought he was in this hut. 
but it doubled round. He'd gone around the wall, and he was trying to run into that industrial there. He had a big train of zombies, so I thought he was bleeding, and then I could just open the door and spray him down. If anyone actually knows what this guy screams as I'm shooting him, that would be appreciated. I've watched this clip over and over, and I cannot make it out. It's something like, don't shoot me, you can have my dick. Maybe he was saying I can have his dinner. Perhaps he had some nice fish and chips I could eat. So after killing that guy, I had a bit of a rush of blood to the head. And I thought I could take on anyone. So I heard some shots outside and I just run straight towards them. It wasn't long before I started to hear some footsteps up in one of the buildings there. I kind of regret going in there after him now. Every now and again, you guys ask me about Frankie. Actually, you ask me about Frankie a whole lot. <laughs> but anyway, I understand. Frankie's a big YouTuber, and you guys are interested to know if he's okay, and when he's going to upload again. I know a lot of you probably haven't heard from him for about five months, I think it is, since he hasn't put a video out. But he has actually posted on social media, explaining exactly why he's had a bit of a break, and if you guys want to know, check out his Facebook page where he goes into detail about why he hasn't uploaded, why he's had a bit of a break. And uh, yeah, just go and check that out. And some good news for you guys is me and Frankie are working behind the scenes on another Armour Free DayZ video. So I hope you guys are going to enjoy that. That would be out in the future. We're working hard. But here's a little peek of a little bit of behind the scenes of the making of that video that's coming out shortly. There won't be any spoilers. That's in this one. Um, when we, when you'd leave all Mac sh all Sada shit as well. Right, so we're coming around here, Sada. Gonna go through this shit. Oh wow. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh my, oh, my god. God. oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, my so little heart. <laughs> oh, my little heart, dude. That's just what that... the fuck? <laughs> we yeah. have been brooding in the jungle, haven't we, about Steve's death every night, reminiscing, telling stories, haven't we, about how beautiful his fur was. Yeah. <laughs> his he wasn't boots. a normal cow with all that fur, but, like, yeah. we loved it. I know, and as for milking him, blimey, he made some noise, she made some noise, didn't she, when you milked him? I think, yeah, but you were milking the wrong thing initially, like, was that's I? not, like, yeah, yeah. I think, I think he thought it was the right thing, to be honest with you, he loved it. <laughs> Every night, putting his hands in my face, going, milk me, you bitch. Milk me. <laughs> Every night he wanted milking. <laughs> Uh, no, no, just see if you can get the truck. Okay, I'm right near this tank that's down in the uh, valley there. Um, I don't know where you are, I don't know where you are. I'm gonna try and roll out. Whoa, he's like, he's like, kill me. Okay, uh, dude, I'm good. No, 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 I'm good. Uh, I, right, I didn't right. see him kill me. Dude, this bullet is fine, literally right past me right now. I know, I know. Okay, I'm healed, I'm healed. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that. A little look behind the scenes of the latest Armour Free video that we're doing. Frankie's fine, he's alive, everything's okay. Uh, we're recording behind the scenes. And yeah, all is good. Also, just to announce the winners of the GTX 1080 graphics card and the new motherboard, the Z270 motherboard, are... Oh! Should be on the screen now. Congratulations to you guys. I've already emailed both of you, and as soon as you let me know your address, they'll be sent out to you. I hope you enjoyed the graphics card. I hope you enjoyed the motherboard, and I hope you enjoyed the video. We had a little look at some Daisy standalone and what to expect when Beta comes out, and also we answered the question, where is Frankie? Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time. I can hear it, dude. It's coming cool through. They're, they're coming, they're coming. I hope we do better than we did last week. Yeah, so. You can hit right, that first I need to stand one, yeah. right out the fucking end of here so I don't RPG myself again.
Ready. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna open up. Oh, it's not me. Are you good? Uh, you know, I'm around. not fucking good. You're not. Uh, I can do some help, mate. Come out. Oh, oh my god. I shot my camo net down. <laughs> <laughs> There's a tank with flames on me, Frankie! <laughs> Sadly, oh we're out, God. we're out, dudes. We're out, dudes. The, the RPG system is in the kill. Like, so, we'll just have to leave this scene in my house.